Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, Grand Community. The country director of US, uh, UAG, the government committee in charge of disbursement of UAG UAS grant, CEOs and captain of industries in the system, subscribers of UAG, true fighters, our mothers and fathers in the system. Ladies and gentlemen, I remain your brother and friend, Reverend Moses from Abuja. This afternoon, I came to myself and I feel we should uh, call those people responsible for the UAG, US disbursement to awareness. Silence is said to be golden, but this silence is no longer golden. This is half of the year gone, and up to now, there seems to be no headway towards the successful disbursement of UAG grabbers. One ugly trend that continues to thrive in the system is Tuesday, Thursday, Wednesday, Thursday this week, Tuesday to Thursday this week, next week, Tuesday, Tuesday to Thursday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Wednesday, Thursday has never come to an end. And you say we should keep quiet. I don't know, maybe because you are comfortable in your glass houses, and some other people are in their mud houses and in their thatch houses. And you are comfortable with what you are doing. You have to take cognizance of the plight of the common man. If you don't know, it is no longer funny in Nigeria. It's no longer funny anywhere in the system. I was surprised one day I was passing through a footpath and I saw two women trying to uh, dress up a table and I went closer to where they were trying to dress something and I discovered they were dressing pepper on the table and it was two pepper for 100 naira two pepper, one two pepper for hundred naira. If pepper, two pieces of pepper has become hundred naira, that means a piece of pepper is fifty naira. How will a common man breathe as the slogan was used during the campaign? The government committee that is in charge or saddled with the responsibility of this grant if you are in glass houses, do not throw stones because you do not have stones. The common man have stones, as the saying goes. Do not allow the common man to begin to pick stones and before you do the needful. I want to call on the leadership of UAG, Apostle Professor Ambassador Dr. Ken Wakama. We appreciate your resilience, your focus. You've received several bullets on our behalf. We want to join our voice with you to call on the government committee and the committee in charge of this disbursement that we are tired. I want to repeat it, we are tired. The silence is too much. We've refused to make noise on the social media so that it's great, but it's like, our quietness has been taken for cowardice and we will not want to take it again. We don't want to take it again. The government committee now, as I always say, is better we die in hunger than to die in prison. If you are not careful, the masses will come out and they will prefer themselves to die in prison where you will feed them cheaply than for them to go about and die on streets. If that is what you want to see littered on the streets of Nigeria, the poor masses are no longer breathing, they are choked with poverty, choked with hardship, 
check with difficulties subscribers and CEOs that are expecting this disbursement my friends and colleagues should we fold our hands and wait for this quietness when will this quietness end it's like there is no deadline for our keeping quiet should we keep quiet like that until our life ends should we keep life keep quiet like that until our subscribers mop up ceos i believe some ceos will come out and say we are at the door we have had these slogans we have had this statement we have this encouragement we are fed up we have abused english to the fact that some english words do not mean exactly what they mean in dictionaries again such words are very soon sacrosan very near very close between now and next week between now and these words have been battered in grand community they are of no effect the dictionary definition of these words are no longer tenable in grand community ladies and gentlemen our keeping quiet is assume we are afraid our not talking is assume we don't know what should be done but i don't think it's like the, the government committee's matter should for a matter of urgency call those who are responsible and hand over what is uh, res what is needed for disbursement to start immediately you may not like the counter reaction of somebody who is hungry somebody who is hopeless somebody who who has nowhere to go when he reacts he reacts terribly i'm not inciting the public to come up against the government of the day neither the government committee that are saddled with responsibilities of disbursing this uh, notable grant but i'm trying to call the government to be at a, to be on attention to rise up to its challenge and do the needful the disbursement committee please and please if you are comfortable we are no longer comfortable with the system we are no longer comfortable that soon we are no longer comfortable the the child will soon be bad we are no longer comfortable with all the slogans we are no longer comfortable we no longer agree with whatever you are saying it's like you have played us to keep quiet and why you do what you want to do we must appreciate those of you who have worked tirelessly to make sure that this grant come on board but nevertheless we will not allow this thing to just go like that our suffering are becoming intense our subscribers are coming after us and we will keep quiet like that it is no longer tenable please and please i want to call on all ceos all subscribers of uag apart from prayers let us go back again to call on this government committee and disbursement committee to stand up to their responsibility and do the disbursement now it's either we get it now or never i appreciate all of you who have listened to me let's come up back on social media and tell the government committee the disbursement committee it's like they don't know that we are tired but i want them to know that we are tired uh, anyhow we will cry for them to know that we are tired it should be done so that they will know that truly the masses are tired the quietness the promise and fail the next week syndrome the this month is the month is the promised month is no longer accepted thank you very much i remain your brother and friend reverend moses from abuja today is the 11th day of july 2024 good afternoon